I know there's a lot of emotions to process right now. There's probably pride in there, and there's disappointment, obviously, in the short term. Can you describe what you're feeling right now? Uh, I'm, I'm really just, I wouldn't say sad, because I'm not sad. I'm, I'm proud of these guys, but I'm proud of my brothers. Uh, I would just say just, I'm very disappointed that I can't come in here and, and practice with these dudes again tomorrow or the next day and, and, and get ready for the national championship. What are you the most proud of about this season, what you guys have accomplished? Just our, our will to win and like how much better we got and the standard that we hold each other to. Uh, we just trusted in the coaching staff and, and learned how to win. And it, we just we just held each other to that standard every game. We're extremely proud of our guys' effort uh, in the ride they took us on for five or six months or however long it's been. These guys laid it on the line every single practice, every single workout, weight session, film session. They put a lot into this, and sometimes it just doesn't go your way. We're definitely bonded for life. Um, this wasn't anything just on the court, like off the court. We're brothers. We're a uh, big family, so I love each and every one of these guys. You and Michael Forrest will be, uh, the whole team will be forever bonded, but to say goodbye to him as a teammate. Man, I mean, that's a tough goodbye. Uh, Mike, he's a legend. Uh, his jersey will be in the rafters uh, soon. Um, I mean, he taught me a lot of things, just sitting back and watching uh, him work, and um, he, he did a lot of sacrificing this year for the better of the team. And, and um, I mean, for him to go out this way, uh, it's tough, but I mean, um, I mean, you could, when you think of Mike Forrest, you're going to think of a, a legend at FAU and a champ. He really witnessed the come up of FAU. You know, he, he came in with Dustin May. Um, and just to know that he's not going to be here, you know, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be sad, you know, because uh, he's a great teammate, great leader, and we're going to miss him. No one had a better perspective of the rise of the FAU basketball team than Michael Forrest, at least from a player's perspective. And he did it all while getting his degree in mechanical engineering so michael forrest's future is bright and the future of the fau basketball team is also bright now we mentioned the miami hurricanes uconn continued their tear through the ncaa tournament beating them 72 to 59 so no south florida teams in the national championship game on monday but both the canes and the owls can't wait to get back next season continue to show the nation what they are made of. Reporting from NRG Stadium in Houston, Texas, John Evanson, CBS 12 News.